Joining us today, we have Paul McKenzie. Today, we are talking about knife crime, the black community in respect of politics, Brexit, and business, all coming up on the show. He had to change his beliefs to their beliefs to become the one. Wow. So did he really even exist? Wow. Or did they just want somebody like Neo to save the world? And you know and I know as an adult, if you're fearful of something, unless you investigate what that fear is, mm -hmm. you're always going to be fearful of it. Mm -hmm. So we need to start to, back to the narrative again. Yes. Unless we start changing and identifying what yeah. is the fear? What is this bogeyman that, yes. that young people are afraid of? Yeah. The community's got its part to play. Yeah. We as uh, individuals have all got our part to play. Yeah. And I've always said this, and I say this all, all the time in my videos, mm -hmm. is that we, we were at the stage that debates are dead. Yeah. So let's stop debating about what, you know, why young people are doing this, yeah. why young people are doing this, when you can spend less time debating and just an hour of your time engaging. But with young people, um, a platform like Urban News shows potential. Mm -hmm. It shows that if you're a young editor or if you have content which is positive, it can be displayed globally on a platform mm -hmm. that is only going to share uh, real-time information. Yes. So it's going to share, yeah, it will share news which is negative and it will mm -hmm. also share news which is, is positive. positive yes. But it, would, it will attempt to create more of a positive sandwich for what we want to yes. see. Yes. You know, because nobody wants to know that their child may not come home from school.